Uh, I want to start by uh, saying that content moderation, like removing uh, posts or banning accounts, is about treating symptoms. And I think that we need to treat symptoms, uh, but I also think that we need to address two underlying diseases. The first is that your products amplify extremism. The second is that your business models of targeted ads enable misinformation to thrive because you chase user engagement at great cost to our society. So to Mr. Pachai, uh, last month, the Anti-Defamation League found that YouTube amplifies extremism. Scores of journalists and researchers uh, agree. And here's what they say happens. A user watching an extremist video uh, is often recommended more such videos, slowly radicalizing the user. YouTube is not doing enough to address recommendations, and it's why Representative uh, Malinkowski and myself introduced um, uh, the Protecting Americans uh, from Dangerous Algorithms Act to narrowly amend Section 230 so courts can examine the role of algorithmic amplification that leads to violence. And it's also why uh, I, along with 40 of my House colleagues, wrote to each of you about this issue. And Mr. Chairman, I ask uh, that those letters be placed into the record. So my question to you, um, Mr. Pichai, is are you willing to overhaul uh, YouTube's core recommendation engine to correct this issue? Yes or no? Uh, Congresswoman, we have overhauled our recommendation systems, and uh, I know you've engaged on these issues before, uh, pretty substantially in pretty much any area. But there, uh, uh, Mr. Pichai, yes or no, because we still have a huge problem. And I, I outlined what they are. Are you saying that the Anti-Defamation League doesn't know what they're talking about? Um, uh, we, you know, uh, 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 all these journalists and researchers. Uh, there is a lot more to address. And that's why I'm asking you if you're willing to overhaul YouTube's core recommendation uh, engine to correct this. It's serious. It's dangerous. Uh, what more can I say about it? Yes or no? Congresswoman, if I may explain. We have no, I don't have time to explain. So, uh, 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 we, you know, let me just say this to uh, 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 to the witnesses. We don't do filibuster in the House. That's something that's done in the Senate. So uh, a filibuster doesn't work with us. Uh, to Mr. Zuckerberg, your algorithms use unseemly amounts of data to keep users on your platform because that leads to more ad revenue. Now, businesses are in business to make money. We all understand that. But your model has a cost to society. The most engaging posts are often those that induce fear, anxiety, anger, and that includes deadly, deadly misinformation. The Center for Countering uh, Digital Hate found that the explore and suggested post parts of Instagram are littered with COVID misinformation, election disinformation, and QAnon posts. So this is dangerous, and it's why Representative Shikowsky and I are uh, uh, doing a bill that is going to ban this business model of surveillance advertising. So are you willing to redesign your products to eliminate your focus on addicting users to your platforms at all costs? Yes or no? Congresswoman, as I said before, the teams that design our algorithms... You know, I, I, I think, I, I, let me just say this, and it's I think it's irritating all of us, and that is that no one seems to know the word yes or the word no. Which one is it? If you don't want to answer, just say, I don't want to answer. So uh, yes or no? Congresswoman, these are nuanced issues. And okay, so we're... I'm going to say uh, that's a no. Uh, to Mr. Dorsey, as the chairwoman of the Health Subcommittee, uh, I think that you need to eliminate all COVID uh, misinformation and not label or reduce its spread, but remove it. Uh, I, I looked at um, uh, a tweet this morning. Uh, Robert Kennedy Jr. Uh, links the death of baseball legend Hank Aaron to the COVID vaccine, even though fact checkers debunked the story 
the tweet has 9,000 retweets. Um, will you take this down and 